Welcome to the introduction video to Notepad Classic. My name is Robert and I built this application because I really wanted a nice simple Notepad application similar to what we've had in Windows for years. And as such, I really wanted to try and get as many of the same sort of features as we had in Notepad. When you initially launch it, you see it's kind of a little bit different to normal Windows 8 applications. We have a more ribbon-like experience at the top there uh, instead of the sort of more uh, Windows design style experience where this would potentially be at the bottom of the screen but this is really makes it feel a lot more f like Windows uh, like a normal notepad as application um, as you can see here you know, we have sort of all the same things in here so we'll have fi we have find we have a uh, replace uh, go to even date time um, and some and the sort of status information I even have a word count which wasn't in the original one I really have also tried to make sure that this works with many of the same keyboard shortcuts so if i hit Control o it will go and do an open we can go off load some text here and if i hit Control f it'll bring up the find dialog box and we're able to search in there and let find text for us and so it's really quite nice and useful the top uh ribbon type menu is actually an app bar so i can actually use the, the control to get it away and this really gives you a nice rich full screen experience um, we also make sure we have lots of options in here so we can go in here and change all the settings around so you may decide you want a really uh, sort of matrix type feel for this and so we can go in here and change the colors around a lot and if we go back we can also change the font so I'm using console this year, but maybe you want to go off and use something like Deja Vu Sans Myrna. And we could turn off word wrappings. So we have it all on one long line. It is a fully touch supported UI. So you'll note that when I tap with the keyboard, the keyboard comes in. It won't over wrap any text. It actually handles that quite well. And then if I drag the window off into a snap view, and uh, we handle the snap view experience just as well there. And this is, I find I use a lot, it's just for sort of, if we get rid of that, um, and I'll go back to the normal keyboard mode, it's just making quick notes while I'm browsing web pages and so on in Metro, and really is a nice sort of experience. And then when I'm ready to save it, I can go back in and save that file if I wish. I think this is a very nice, simple, useful tool to, to have installed on your machine. Uh, maybe not the tool you use all the time, but is a t definitely a tool that uh, you'll find lots of good useful. Thank you for taking the time to look at this video.